Hello and welcome to Leicester Museum and Art Gallery. We have created memory trails in three of the museums and this short film will introduce you to the trail at Leicester Museum and Art Gallery. Sharing stories and memories with friends and families makes us happy, which improves our health and well-being. We all like to take a trip down memory lane and museums have many objects that can trigger memories. Use the memory trail at Leicester Museum and Art Gallery and you will be surprised just how many conversations you can have with people. The 10 objects on the trail have been specifically chosen for our older visitors and are a dementia friendly resource. They are also a great way for older and younger people to connect and learn more about each other's lives. Sit back and relax as we take you on the trail and show you how the objects can start conversations about how people lived and how much has changed over the years. Objects. Number one, the Rutland Dinosaur. Dinosaur skeletons are displayed in museums around the world. The 15 metre Rutland Dinosaur has been towering above visitors since 1985 and is one of the best loved exhibits at the museum. Start a conversation by asking, do you remember the first time you saw a huge dinosaur skeleton displayed in a museum? Number two, Barwell Meteorite. This is one of the oldest objects in the museum and there are a lot of old things here. Some objects are found by members of the public, like this one found in 1968 on an allotment. Start a conversation by asking, do you have anything in your family that is old and has been passed down through generations? Any family heirlooms? Number three, tiger. Seeing wild animals in museums may well have been the first time you saw a wild animal this close. Start a conversation by asking, as a child, did you ever have a trip to the zoo? What do you remember about it? Number four, Disney tea set. Disney characters and films have transported us to magical places over the years. Start a conversation by asking, did you go to the cinema when you were a child? Was it a special occasion? Number five, the railway station painting. This painting of Paddington Station, London, depicts a family in the hustle and bustle of Victorian England. Start a conversation by asking, do you remember any train journeys as a child? Were they exciting? Number six, dancing statue, Dega. Dancing has always been depicted in paintings and in sculpture, such as this bronze statue of a dancer by Dega. Start a conversation by asking, as a teenager, did you go to dances? What do you remember? Number seven, armchairs. Chairs are something that we all use daily. Some chair styles are still around today, like these by arts and crafts designers from around the 1890s. Start a conversation by asking, did you have your special chairs in the front room for Sundays and special occasions only? Number eight, mummies. Mummies and pyramids are the objects that most make us think about ancient Egypt and trips to museums. Start a conversation by asking, did you learn about mummies and pharaohs at school? Number nine, temporary exhibitions. Two galleries in the museum show exciting new displays.
have a look around them, see what is on display and if any of the objects trigger any memories. Start a conversation by asking, what is the best or most impressive thing you have ever seen in a museum or art gallery? Number 10, museum building. As children, we all remember day trips to the museum with school or family. This well-known city centre attraction has been here since 1849. The striking entrance looks as familiar now as it did many years ago. Start a conversation by asking, do you remember the first time you went to a museum? We hope you enjoyed exploring the objects on the trail. You can pick up a printed copy of the trail in the museum and you can view it on the Leicester Museums and Galleries website. You will find more suggestions for starting conversations about shared experiences. The map of the trail will show you where the objects are. You can always ask one of the friendly museum staff for help in locating an object. Two other trails are available to explore in Newark Houses and Abbey Pumping Station. Remember, museums are free to visit and we look forward to welcoming you in one of them soon.